welcome back to my channel hope all of you are doing well today i'm going to talk about ondc open network for digital commerce government hopes to replicate upi's model success existing we have platform centric model so it's going to be changed to ondc now with the concept of ondc you need not download several e-commerce apps you just need to download the ONDC app or visit the website and purchase goods from there. In the ONDC concept, several e-commerce companies such as Flipkart and Amazon will list their products there. Open Network for Digital Commerce is a private, non-profit Section 8 company established by Department for Promotion of Open E-Commerce. Open platform for selling and buying goods online. For example, right now if you want to purchase a laptop online, then you need to download Flipkart or Amazon app separately. At present, there are a lot of e-commerce platforms. But with the concept of ONDC, you did not download all the e-commerce sites. ONDC will work similarly as UPI. In case of UPI, you need to download an UPI system. In the same way, in case of ONDC, several, several apps need not be downloaded for transaction. The main purpose of ONDC is to end the monopoly of some big e-commerce companies such as Flipkart and Amazon. Advantages of ONDC, you did not download several apps, you can shop with one, day, one app, so this will bring an end to the big monopoly of big e-commerce platforms. It will not be an end to Flipkart and Amazon, but it will give a chance to all the small businesses to rise up. Thus ONDC is a network based on open protocol, a UPI of e-commerce seeks to democratize digital on or electronic commerce moving it from a platform centric model to an open network. In this system ONDC plans to enable sellers and buyers to be digitally visible and transact easily. According to the government's official statement, ONDC shall take all measures to ensure confidentiality and privacy of data in the network. 